Hey guys, it's Dice Start. And today, this one we also be going on the main channel as well. So pretty much, I be um asking you guys if you guys support me being gender fluid. And before I go any further, I have to give a big thanks to one of my all-time big supporters, Zeiss. They are the most supportive subscriber I ever had. Like I never had a describer that when I was when I was in a bad spot because this computer for the reason is not letting me go live still, so you know. That's the thing. But you know, I'm making videos sometimes I not very often as I usually do. Because now my school started a couple of days ago with e learning. You know, that's the thing. I think that's probably when you're what are you getting? Oh, well, you're getting this. This is my gender fluid flag. It's good. Right here, you can probably see it. Hopefully, you guys can still hear me from here. As you can see, this is my gender fluid flag. If you guys couldn't hear me, you're pretty much saying that was my gender fluid flag. Yeah, honestly. This way I have the guys I had to identify as gender fluid. It pretty much don't know what gender fluid is. It pretty much means that it means that some days I feel like you know, sometimes I feel like a young boy. I got I go by two names. My girl one is Evie. My boy one's Elijah. This is my real name. But my Online press's name is Destoy. But I gave myself that name. Never since I've been using it ever since. So, like, yeah. So, pretty much, being gender fluid, as I said, means sometimes I feel like if you're sometimes being a boy, and there's nothing really wrong with it. Just, that's why I have a bunch of girl clothes at the bottom of here. Sometimes I go shopping with my aunt, my sister goes shopping for like some dresses, skirts, leggings, pants, shirts, stuff like that. And like, I see, I see nothing wrong with it. First of all, like, okay, hopefully you guys can hear me way way better now. So pretty much, yeah. The reason why I love doing wearing girl stuff, painting my nose, stuff like that, because I was just born like that. Like I love just doing it because that's. Makes me feel, feel so, so happy about doing it. You guys are wondering. Hey, Jester. I support you, then that's good. Because, like, if you do support me, then that's good. Because, you don't know, I'm actually part of the LGBTQ plus community. Because I'm in the fluid. It has many, many, many names, you know. I'm, Gender queer, gender fluid, gender non non confirming, stuff like that. Same mean pretty much. I would say meaning, but me I'm just I haven't really figured out how to much Evie and Elijah together quite yet. So I might need you guys help for that. But you know Yeah, honestly, I love you know like being gender fluid and being all that. And yeah. And before the layout was like different layout before it. I have a bed, an actual bed now. And yeah, pretty, pretty much, I, pretty much all time fluid means that I love doing girl stuff. It just wearing girl clothes, makeup, dresses, nail polish, stuff like that. Like honestly, my friends 100% support me being it. The friend I talked to in streams before is Kristen. He knows what gender fluid is to raid out because I told him and he 100% supports it. Like, he had to have his friend as a guy, so I'm like, you know what? If you support. Like, I was kind of scared at first to tell him, but then I go and numbered, hey, he supports my transgender friend. He probably will support me, and you know what? He did, and I'm thankful that he does. Hopefully, it's not an all an act, but I, I know it's not because like, he's too nice of a person to do that to me. That's like, yeah. Pretty much the term that I don't throw it in, yeah. So, here's a tip you guys are part of the LGBTQ, 
LG BTQ Plus community. It's hard being part of that community for one reason. That reason is, is that sometimes it's hard to come out to people, come out to your friends. And I'm very sorry talking about this in person because the reason why it's so hard because think of it this way. Let's say that you were that your friend was gay or lesbian or whatever, and they came out to you and you didn't know what that was, and you just says you like that, then that wouldn't be really nice. So like sometimes we better do research on the community so you know exactly what it is we expect you when you do come out to you. And yeah. It's very scary to come out because like you don't know if your friends will A betray you, B hit on you. Which means like say me things, pretty much betray yep, betray you, or B still be your friend and accept you. Stuff like that. And like I created a video on Death Dev Vlogs of talking about my friend betraying me. So go check out got that video. But this is, video is going to main channel. Let's see how how the video goes on my channel, my main one. But pretty much, yeah, being in the floor is it sort of hard for me because like I love wearing good clothes. When I feel like I'm good, I always like either wear dress or like leggings or like. Whatever I think goes away pretty much, so I represent as one pretty much. And like I love how my like, my family supports me in it and my friends do as well. Which is really, really good because having support from your family that you that you say let's be in K friends and do fluid. I don't really know all <laughs> all of them. Like it gets confusing for me after a while. One thing that's confusing is the grades and how they work in high school. Like, it doesn't make sense to be a junior when you graduate from junior high. I don't know why they added junior. It didn't really make sense. The school. Now, I'll be laying on, the, on, it, on my thing. And pretty much having... A clo nice close conversation. So yeah. Oh God. Okay. I gotta remember it's not that close. So pretty much yeah, it's pretty much that would be much being in the fluid means stuff like that. Sometimes it's hard being part of the community, as I said, because, like, yeah. So I dropped my mic, I didn't mean to do that. It's, like, it's on a small table right now, so, like, yeah. So pretty much, sometimes my feet to my like to look some nice girl clothes. When I look on YouTube, like, YouTube, like, nice girl clothes, like, from an age, stuff like that all the time, that's not a good bad idea. How to look more nice and stuff like that. So pretty much, yeah. And if if this channel is able to be revived this year, if I do get a new gaming PC this year, that'd be better. Okay, I need to talk about one step at a time. I'm bad at that. My bad. But you know, being part of of a community that supports you no matter what is great. I met so many people. Play Minecraft. That's part of the LGBTQ plus community, and like it also. That's one of the things that's like really really cool. I think I might take this down. What do you mean by that? You guys can't really see it, but I might. Hold on. I might take this down, but you know, I might take this whole thing down. Pretty Why is it? Get that whole thing down pretty much. Yeah. In pretty much. Out there.
And yeah, pretty much being gender fluid myself. This is the reason I'm talking about this because like yeah. Because being gender fluid is something that's difficult for me to talk about like when like other girls talk about oh I'm gonna be doing this, doing this. And I'm going to think about like painting my nails and you know like going shopping with like my family going I'm gonna be like getting some cute girl clothes. Like it's really, really hard for me to talk about this stuff out in public. Because like I'm just shy about that stuff. Like I'm the type of person that's shy about being turned and fluid all the time, but I shouldn't. I shouldn't be the same that I am. And I do look good in mustache, let's let's just say that. What do you know? Let's talk about that in another video. <laughs> what do you know? The one thing that guys probably didn't expect me to be is a dental fluid Minecraft gamer, pretty much. And I wasn't expecting that either. Being a YouTuber, but you know, it's not just being a YouTuber, it's standing out. This is what I'm trying to do. Well, you know, sometimes it's hard and difficult, but you know, I know thanks to Zeiss, it's thanks to that it's. I've been watching a lot of the SP one animatic recently, and that band getting me up my feet. But well, you know what? No. I was down, but no, I'm not. I know I keep saying this, but like, I've been really thinking about maybe keep doing this while I'm on my main one to see if this will work. Because, like, honestly. I've been really thinking about that recently, and like, yeah, like honestly, like honestly, there we go. You guys know it's something different now. It's actually is it's in the right place. Yeah, how like my arms. Is actually matching for one. See now that no one moves this arm, you know. Yeah, now I know something different. And I did that so that it looks kind of better when I do this. Pretty much, I get, I get really annoyed. Like yeah, but pretty much, yeah. Pretty much, as I said, that person that gets shy around this type of stuff. I'm gonna be fixing that because I knowing me. Okay, and that's better. Pretty much, what we're going to use is long time at six C twenty. So you know that's pretty good for vlogging stuff. I take very good care of it. I take care of my mic and my keyboards and stuff like that. And yeah, if I can find a way to record on my Xbox as well one of these days, and yeah. But if I do get a USB three point oh, then we would record stuff. Record up to an hour. Yeah. Then was sorry, but pretty much, yeah. Your friend comes out to you as like transgender, saying, "Hey, I feel like more of a let's say that your friend is was born trans sex as a girl, then you want to transition to your boy because they feel like that." And, you, and she goes, "Hey, Steve, or whatever your name is, I'm transgender, and I would rather call you." Rather be called by my male pronouns and by my male name. And yeah, if you accept them, then good. But if you don't be that weird person, calls me names, and you just want to be like a straight up bully to them, then you know, you're going to want, you know, like missing out on like hanging out with them, stuff like that. But then, like, yeah. But. Being turned transgender is not and not bad at all. I have a friend that is and I support it one hundred percent. This male to female transgender and when she told me I was like, eh. Who really cares? If you if you feel like that then there's nothing I can really do to tell you you're not transgender. You're not. I can't tell you you can't tell my friend that it's not. Because that to be straight up bullying and I'm not type of person. I would bully someone being transgender. At all, like I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't do it if someone was gay, lesbian, is a straight, or gender fluid, gender non binaries, or like any other spec gender spectrum or anything else in it. 
LGBTQ plus community. Because I'm for one, I wouldn't treat them harm with any horse at all. The only person I'm probably going to treat a horse is someone that I probably would hate on me, one of my friends being part of it. One of my friends that are allies to it, they'd be like, you're wrong for this, you're dumb. But honestly, I'll never do that. What's Tina gonna be doing is avoiding her a lot, but that, that's only because, you know, I want to hang out with my friend Christian. I haven't hang out with him like since forever, so you know. I hang out with her probably tomorrow if I can. Yeah, tomorrow. Yeah. Pretty much, yeah. Being dead and fluid is something difficult for me to talk about, because I'm not really used to talking about it up in public. But you know, I'm trying to get my subscribers back, I'm trying to do whatever it takes for me. Just to become a YouTuber. Because, like, I... It's hard for me not to be streaming, that's for sure. It's hard. It's definitely hard. But, you know... I mean, I know if the video here. If you guys liked it, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe. And again, big, big, huge thanks to Zeiss. They deserve... There was a guy called Zeiss, I don't know if it's a he or see, so no. If I don't know the pronouns... To a boy or girl, or like they, then you know, whether we call they or them, then you know, I call them they, let's be um safe, you know. Pretty much, Slice pretty much told me, you know, pretty much, I pretty much tell you right now, pretty much, I'm the one that said I'm gonna quit YouTube. Hold on. Pretty much stuff like that. This one. Pretty much. As I said, I want you to do what you think is best for your house. I know that we as your fans would love for you to keep making content. But if you aren't doing well because of it, then you should stop. I love your content and maybe in a while you can come back. Like that's why he's moderated doing my service. If you ever come to my like self because see he's they mine because I twice them for one like like honestly they're like a very good game yeah, pretty much yeah pretty much yeah if you guys liked the video don't forget to leave a like subscribe and thanks again for guys for giving me motivation and you know Make sure I was okay, and you know, do everybody doing whatever you can to make sure that I'm all right, safe, stuff like that. Honestly, you as a subscriber, it's a person, it's really nice, and it's general for you. But like in a while, I'm going to stick around and see how they're doing. You know, I'm doing just fine, honestly. And I was with my family, I play Minecraft a lot with my with my friends. And yeah, pretty much, yeah. I said to leave a like, subscribe. I want to see more vlogs on the main channel. You know, leave a like, put a like on it. Let's go for maybe two likes in day's video. I don't know. But you know. Again, this was Death Star from the Death Star Army. And I'll probably be coming back and making vlogs on the main channel. So, yeah. And keep walking and rolling. I don't know my sock is walking rolling, so you know, keep walking rolling. And yeah, I can probably end, end the video here. But, again, it's big thanks to Zeiss for being my spin-off game, you know, my sponsor. But, you know, they are big help. They are big help. Let me motivate it. Zeiss. Thank you, Zeiss. If you're watching this, big, big thanks. But keep me motivated. It was for you. I wouldn't be able to keep doing YouTube. And yeah. Thanks. And I pretty much catch you guys next time.
This time I won't be ten sir. But I don't know when it will be next time. I don't have a schedule quite yet. I'm gonna be uh, loading vlogs on the main one, but you know. Yeah, pretty much get the next time. Bye.